David with entry number 593 here again in uh, near my home actually this is on the uh, opposite side of a very busy thoroughfare this way over here and uh, so this is a very residential area um, if you can't tell I'm sweating profusely at the moment it's extremely humid yesterday actually right now I can't show you but I'm looking at the very tippity top of the Mormon temple. I can see the little Moroni blowing his bugle. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, Moroni is that little golden man that they put on top of the temples. Anyway, um, this is a very residential area. These buildings you see to the left and right are all apartments. Um, these are kind of smaller apartments. These are kind of the old school ones before they started making like those real commercial giant ones that I showed you on the previous entry where they're like 20, 30 stories and just like completely faceless and have no character. These ones are older and generally have a bit of a patina on them. Um, but yeah, the weather yesterday was uh, pretty epic, I would say. That's the only way to really describe it. Um, currently, I think I've mentioned this before, but we are right in the uh, thick of rainy season here in Korea. Um, it's also known as monsoon season. And I'm just going to go look at something really quick over here. And I want to steal that, but it's too big. Oh, God. All right. Here in Korea, actually, there's a thing I haven't mentioned this before, I don't think. But um, it's perfectly, like, legal to take trash here. And um, a lot of people, what you're supposed to do is you... If it's a big item, you schedule a pickup, kind of like in the U.S., and they'll just take it away. But you're also, I think, perfectly free to just steal. Not steal, really, because it's trash, but it's perfectly legal to just take stuff that people leave on the street. And you know, so I was, you know, I'm always keeping my eye open for stuff. Occasionally, there are some things that are actually worth taking when they, when they throw away, like, big kind of ticket items. Uh, comes a couple times I've seen people trying to throw away, like, refrigerators and stuff and you know those things cost maybe like a thousand dollars so it's something that that you can just take um what am i saying oh yeah rainy season it is uh quite um how to describe it quite wet um the humidity is like palpable i would say is the um, best way to describe apologies for the closeness um, but yeah it's it's very humid all the time and um, people are sweating a lot and it's kind of stinky and a lot of people's clothes they don't know how to like properly take care of their clothes like a lot of people's clothes have like mildew all over them and they stink and yeah it's kind of a sucky time here in Asia uh, it's probably I would say the worst time because you know, when it's cold, it's just cold. You know, it's bone chill and cold. And you can go back and watch some of my entries when it's, when it's so cold I can't even hold the freaking phone. But um, well, generally, it's like not that bad. But now, this is like, this is like, I don't know, disgusting. Um, and you know, so yesterday, okay, yesterday, ugh, like there was so much freaking, it was pretty much like Singapore for most of the day. Um, it was really intense and um, it wasn't even like enjoyable. It was the kind of rain that just like it wasn't even sheets. It was just like straight up onslaught of rain. I'm gonna record on this main street, so I'm gonna have to end it pretty soon. But uh, hopefully, I can get some talking in. Um, but yeah, it's pretty rough. Um, going to go get groceries, finding like. groceries once a week and then that's it. But here like I ended up on some like, ridiculous schedule where my timing is like up and stuff so I have to buy groceries like three times a week. It's, it's kind of BS. But anyway, it's uh, pretty hot. And so yeah, but everything else is going good. It's uh, life is life is good. Um, I'm pretty happy still. Like, yeah, anyone, really, uh, 
that's only like when I really started like concentrating and kind of uh, stagnating. Not stagnating, but like what's, what's the word? Not commiserate. You stewing and stuff. That's the only time I really feel down, and that's really like very few and far between. A couple of my really good friends came in last uh, yesterday, and I said goodbye to them because they're all heading back next week to their respective home countries. And, uh, that's really good to see them because, you know, I haven't made, I would say, like, a plethora of friends here, but, like, I've made significantly more than I had in the last, like, five years back in the States, so 